Toyota has offered a glimpse of the highly anticipated fifth generation Land Cruiser Prado through its first teaser. This all new model is set to make its global debut in the upcoming months. With its expected unveiling, later this year, the 2024 Toyota Land Cruiser Prado four wheel drive has been tested in the United States. One of the most seasoned SUVs in the Japanese automaker's global fleet, the Toyota Land Cruiser Prado has been in production since 1984. The current generation model launched in 2009, so it's been a really long time. But thankfully, Toyota has recently announced that it is getting ready to unveil a new generation of the Land Cruiser Prado with a teaser image showing the model silhouette next to a 1960s Toyota FJ40. Prado will become a relative of the new Lexus GX SUE, which premiered exactly a month ago. It has exactly the same proportions, an angular body shape and a curved window sill line. Most likely, the side walls of the two SUVs will be almost the same and the main differences will be concentrated in front and behind. The teasers already show that the Land Cruiser Prado receive a vertical front end and a rectangular grille and narrow headlights of a simple shape. Large vertical lights will appear at the back while the rear fenders will most likely not change. Surely the Prado will receive the original trunk lid which may lose the branded LED strip. Powertrains should be basically the same as the GX with a twin-turbo 3.4-litre V6 and four-wheel drive standard, with some kind of hybrid version coming in the future. The chassis will be based on the TNGA frame platform with double wishbone front suspension and multi-link solid axle rear. It will likely be offered with a third row of seats either as an option or standard. And while there's no reveal date just yet, you can be sure to see the SUV revealed this year. Toyota is expected to move the Land Cruiser slightly down market, leaving more room for the Lexus GX in the lineup. While there are no pricing details for the 2025 LC, we believe it will be more affordable than the outgoing model, which was discontinued after the 2021 model year.